Oye, Becky. Oye, Nambra. I believe in God. Oye, Becky, come on, let's do it. So, figure, figure, back, figure, to cut, figure, back. He has been there, figure, back, not half. Oye, Becky, can you make it jump? Oye, Becky, na Nambra. I believe he said, "Oh, the whole from Nigeria, we don't need a number, we don't need." People are believing. But the American man, I'm not from that guy. See the homeless. Eh, I'm not here. You're not here. You're not here. That's why this is a video. I passed to you, but I'm not going to be before. I'm not going to now. Hello, my wonderful people. I'm Imakins, your favorite presenter on this channel. Imakins TV. How are you guys doing? I believe you're doing very fine. If today is your first time of joining us, please, I want you to share our post, follow our page. And like and comment is very very important. Uh, you can also follow us on our YouTube channel at Emma Kings TV and Emma Kings TV. Thank you very much for being part of this platform. I really appreciate you. For without you, I am nobody. So I want to advise most of you who are planning to travel out. Uh, this critical time is not uh, really the good time for you to travel out, unless you think you have excess money. I want to let you know that most people who travel outside the country, most of them are suffering. As you can see this video that you're watching here right now, this man has been in the US for the past eight to nine years, but he's houseless, um, he's, he's jobless, he's doing nothing, he's, he's not doing anything in the United States of America. So I must advise you, for most of you who think that when you get to the United States, you get jobs, you do this, most of our people are stranded in the United States. Most of them are sleeping on the street. Most of them don't have work they are doing. And that is the reason why you see most of our brothers who are outside 10 years, 15 years, they cannot be able to achieve anything. It's because it is not easy for them. So if you have money and you think you have 5 million and somebody is telling you, I'll bring the money, I will take you to the United States, do this for you, you start working. My brother, I advise you to use that money and start business in Nigeria. If not that insecurity is in Nigeria, most of us will not be here. If not that our economy has destroyed, most of us will not be here. Because the more you get money here, the more you spend it, the more you pay taxes, the more you pay excessive uh, tax that you are not even supposed to be paying if you're in your country. So you see this man here, you see, he's from Anambra Neri. Are you getting what I'm saying? He is suffering. He has been suffering in the United States. You see, that is our brother that is trying to interview him to know how they can help him. This is how most of our brothers have died in the foreign countries because they have nothing doing. Hunger will kill them. A lot of things will happen to them. So, if you are planning to travel abroad and you know you don't have excess money, please sit behind and use the little you have to start business. There are a lot of businesses that you can venture into and be able to make money. Now that we have online, you can be able to do your business online and make it go viral and people will notice you. So it wouldn't be good for you to use your last card and give to the agent. At the end of the day, you get there and be stranded and your people will be crying, trying to look for a way to sell land and send you money. It will not, it will not make sense. So my brother, if you are trying to travel abroad, make sure you know your source. Make sure you are well prepared. Make sure you are not being taken unaware. If you get there, you can spend all your money at the, at the, at the edge of entrance. The immigration will not allow you to pass. So tell me, how are you going to do when you are being returned back? Or maybe you can get yourself in UK, in London, or United States, or in Europe, and they deport you in less than one month. Tell me, how are you going to continue? How are you going to cope? So is it not better for you to do something with the little money you have down there? You can decide to learn a handwork and use the money you have to establish it. I have your own private business. Don't work for people. Don't have the mindset that you're going to the street to hustle, to carry all those illegal businesses. It's not going to do you any help. And that is why I am really appreciating our young men who are on social media today, using it to make money. Everything now is now relied on social media. If you're on this platform and you know what you're doing, my brother, you don't even need to travel anywhere. You don't even need to travel anywhere because in your locality, you generate millions of dollars. You generate hundreds of thousands of dollars from your local community. Once you are creative, once you know what you're doing, 
you don't even need to travel you use that money to go and buy good camera buy pokers buy a lot of things and start creating content on facebook you make money are you getting me it's not easy for you to travel abroad so don't kill yourself that uh, a maker is in the united states this person is in europe and i'm still in nigeria let me tell you most people in nigeria are making it more than those in abroad especially now that content creation is involved do you understand so build yourself build your own company don't depend on if you didn't travel you will not make it in life no it's not that way i pray that the nation we are fighting for will come and you see that most of us will come back home and develop our country i get what i'm saying so don't have that notion that when you get to abroad you start packing money it's not that way you can get there and you'll be stranded you can get there and you'll be deported you can get there and hunger wire you what i'm telling you is a practical experience i'm telling you the truth as a brother please listen to my word this man that is here now most of his people think that he has made it maybe you'll be telling them one story or the other before you know it one day he will die and they will go and bury him in the united states there and his life is gone so please for you to avoid this do not travel to abroad unprepared it's not good thank you for joining me on this broadcast today i remain your favorite presenter Emma kids on Emma kids tv please if you haven't followed this page please i want you to follow this page like our post comment and share to go viral that god has let friends know that you are on this platform and follow our youtube channel subscribe at emma kings tv and emma kings Duo. thank you very much and have a wonderful day bye for now this is mk beat production this is mk beat production This is MK Beats Production.